from 30 December 2023, uh, all drinks, including bubble tea, need to have the neutral grape labels. So if they don't have, uh, that means that they are, they, 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 they are healthy. Yeah, I kid you not. Uh. Watch out, because uh, it turns out that understanding a woman uh, is easier than understanding the neutral grape labels. Yeah. So, so, ah, so, all drinks in Singapore uh, now need the neutral grape labels. Uh. This even includes freshly made drinks uh, like coffee from Starbucks or bubble tea. To put it better, uh, as long as it's something you drink, uh, it must have a grape. Uh. Which leads to the question, uh, why some drinks uh, are still not labelled? Eh? No, uh, it's not because their drinks manufactured long ago. I will address this later. Before that, right, you need to know how they are graded. A uh, means it's awful. B uh, means it's basic. Uh. C uh, means can. Uh. D uh, means delicious. Anyways, uh, I'm not kidding. Eh. Okay, uh, this means uh, we can't have... Yeah, I'm not kidding, uh, cause based on taste, uh, that is the truth. Uh. But based on the nutrients, uh, it depends on two things, uh, the sugar level and the saturated fat level. You see, uh, it doesn't matter whether these nutrients uh, are natural or added into the drink. As long as got, uh, then that is included. Uh. This means uh, a bottle of 100% fruit juice uh, is still going to contain lots of sugar cause fruit juice uh, got natural sugar. Ma. A full cream milk uh, will contain lots of saturated fats and also sugar, even when they are all natural. You can see from here on how they are graded based on the grams per 100 ml here. Uh. Once you hit any of the threshold, uh, you will be graded that letter. Uh. Here's something you probably didn't know. Uh. For drinks that use artificial sweetener, uh, does that mean that they cheated since they confirm have no sugar one? Yeah, but look at this. Uh. If you have any sweetener, uh, it cannot be A, so it will likely uh, move to B. This means uh, almost all those zero calorie drinks uh, are actually B, uh, not A. But why didn't you know that? Eh? Simple. Uh. You see, uh, it's actually not compulsory for all drinks to have the neutral grade label printed on them. I know, shocking, right? If the drink uh, is an A or B, uh, then it will be optional. Instead, uh, only drinks with C or D grades uh, need to show it big, big. In fact, this has actually been ongoing since 30 December 2022. Uh. Even for drinks uh, that were manufactured earlier. You see, uh, for drinks that were manufactured earlier, uh, they need to place a neutral grade sticker uh, on the drinks uh, no matter what. Therefore, uh, technically speaking, uh, you should have never drunk anything uh, that is super sweet but yet doesn't have the neutral grade labels. If you have, uh, then stop drinking ketchup, uh, you bodo! This is the reason why if you realize, uh, you seldom see drinks uh, with A or B grades. Most uh, just rather don't include. Uh. Now, moving forward, uh, since 30 December 2023, uh, even freshly prepared drinks like coffee from coffee chains uh, or bubble tea from bubble tea hours uh, must also show the label. Uh. Instead of showing it on the drink, they can be on the menu. But this will not be needed for smaller business first, cause need a lot of resources to do the label thing you want. Eh? Here's one more thing. If the drinks are graded D, they cannot be advertised on media platforms. They can, however, have posters or banners in the place that they are sold. Uh, but the neutral grade uh, must be shown on the posters too. So, is this working? Yes, yeah. A study showed that with the grading system, uh, people do, uh, whether consciously or subconsciously, uh, buy those with A or B rating and avoid C or D drinks. This is also why uh, companies are changing their sugar levels uh, to get a better neutral grade. Uh. And here's a fact. Uh, sugar uh, is indeed the very thing uh, that's causing lots of weight gain. And there's no doubt uh, that removing sugar uh, will lead to better weight management. You can watch this video uh, to know more about this. Uh, and also subscribe to us uh, if you think I learned something.